Electrical impedance tomography is a non-invasive imaging technique used to visualize the distribution of electrical conductivity inside the body. This technology has gained popularity over the years in the field of respiratory care to monitor lung function at the bedside. We created this video to cover the medical definition and provide a brief overview of this topic. So if you're ready, let's get into it. As previously mentioned, Electrical impedance tomography is a non-invasive imaging technique that allows for the assessment of ventilation distribution in real time. It requires the placement of electrodes around the chest, typically between the fourth and fifth intercostal spaces. The electrodes are connected to a computing device with a monitor and a small alternating current is sent from a reference electrode to each electrode around the chest. Impedance is measured between adjacent electrodes as the reference point rotates around the chest in a circular motion and repeats measurements approximately 50 times per second. This captures images that are reconstructed into a real-time animated graphic on the screen, referred to as the dynamic image. The images displayed represent a cross-section similar in perspective to a CT scan looking from the foot of the bed towards the head of the bed. Electrical impedance tomography allows for the monitoring of various forms of asynchrony, such as changes in end expiratory lung impedance, the impact of adjusting the PEEP setting, and lung perfusion at the bedside. The integration of flow volume and pressure readings from the ventilator provides diagnostic tools to determine the PEEP level where overdistension and collapse are balanced. With electrical impedance tomography, the impact of changing ventilator settings on the distribution of ventilation can be assessed by comparing images before and after an adjustment is made. Trends can also be utilized to see stability of ventilator adjustments over time, which is particularly helpful in determining the impact of changing PEEP in patients with certain lung diseases. Furthermore, modern devices have been equipped with the ability to measure the impedance of fluid distribution throughout the lungs, allowing assessment of lung perfusion at the bedside. It can also detect the effect of excessive spontaneous efforts, which reveals the potential harmful consequences of spontaneous breathing in patients with severe ARDS. The capacity to monitor ventilation distribution, PEEP response, asynchrony, the impact of excessive spontaneous effort, and lung perfusion at the bedside has ushered in a new era of bedside monitoring focused on the individualization of mechanical ventilation, which means that electrical impedance tomography is a valuable tool for monitoring the impact of mechanical ventilation on the lungs, leading to better patient outcomes and a reduction in the length of stay in intensive care units. If you want to support the channel, please like and subscribe. I would greatly appreciate it. And there should be some other helpful videos popping up on your screen right about now that I think you will enjoy. And just a quick reminder, we are not doctors. This video is for informational purposes only. Thank you so much for watching. Have a blessed day. And as always, breathe easy, my friend.